Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to do keyboard input. It's sort of like an if statement, so if you don't know how to do those yet, then you might want to go check my other video out. Alright, let's just delete this and just keep num1. It's an integer num1 with a value of 0, and it's public. So we can mess with it and tweak it inside Unity without coding it. All right, so let's go to update. Let's do an if. Now you're wanting to input, so we type input, and we use the dot symbol to search the input class, and we're looking for get key. Or you want to get a key on your keyboard. And then we're going to open the parenthesis and we're going to choose key code. The dot again, the period, the dot, because we're looking for key code and something inside of it. And we want A is fine, just click A. And since we have two open parentheses, this one and this one, we have to close both of them one and two and then like an if statement you have to have a open and close bracket to finish it and then if this is true then do something inside the brackets and we're just going to print a message out debug dot log and then you're going to make your quotations num one is space close quotation add your addition sign and add num one that's the variable the orange part is just a message you got to add the actual variable close it off and then end it with a semicolon so when you push the A key on your keyboard it's going to print out this message make sure you have a script attached to a game object to run the script so if we push the A on your keyboard, it says num1 equals 0, which is true. If we do 3, then push A, num1 is 3, 4, push A, num1 is 4. So that's how you do keyboard input. Now if you wanted to make it where you had to push two buttons at the same time, as like a combo or something or a special move and you would just add an extra input and copy that and paste it and simply put a and symbol and then change this to I guess S maybe so when you, ha when you push A and S at the same time, then it's going to do the message. I think it's asking for us to add an extra parenthesis. Yeah. Save it. out of five so when you push a now nothing happens if you push s nothing happens if you push a and s at the same time num1 is five let me is there anything else i need to tell y'all 
Now you could do a or symbol, which is that, and save it. Give it a value of whatever you want to. Now if you push A, it will say num is 6. Push 9, add 9, then push S. Num one is 9, because you're using OR. It doesn't matter which one you type on your keyboard, as long as you type one of those. An AND means you have to type both of them at the same time. Alright, thanks for watching. Please subscribe.